morning everyone this is sam from forever sparkles so today i thought i would share with you something um <clears throat> that i bought from amazon i just thought i'd do a little unboxing and maybe work on a little bit of it um so what i have is some diamond painting christmas cards Bought two different kinds, they were on offer on Amazon. Um, they were really cheap. One was like five pounds something, one was six pounds something. So I have 15 cards all together, which I thought was a steal. So we'll do this one first. So I hope everyone is having a lovely day. Did you have a nice weekend? What did you not to? So this shows us what cards we have. So we have Santa um, above the chimney, Santa in a plane, uh, a little Christmas tree, just a Santa face, Santa with his reindeer, Christmas tree, penguin and a polar bear. So they look lovely. Just put that out of the way there. Move these and we'll have a look at the cards. I've been wanting to get these for ages, but they were just so expensive. And while they were on offer, I thought, well, I might as well. So I love this one, it's so cute. And there's quite a lot of details on this one. So we've got Ho Ho Ho, and we have Merry Christmas. That's Santa going down the chimney with his big sack. And then we have Santa in his aeroplane. Merry Christmas to you and your family. I like that. That's cute. And he's dropping the presents out of the bottom of the plane. This one's nice. It's nice and simple. Merry Christmas. Nice little tree. Oh, I'll turn on the other way. Santa's face and Merry Christmas. Lovely. That's quite simple. There's like four or five colours on that one. Very nice. Oh, this one's so cute. I love the little reindeers. Oh, we've got some special drills here. By the looks of it. Come on, camera focus. The light is terrible in here today, I do apologise. Then we have another Christmas tree which just says Merry Christmas. It's only three colours on that. Oh, but then we could do have the special drills at the side here. It's a penguin! It's lovely. realised there's no polar bear okay there's supposed to be eight in this kit but there's only seven so I will get in touch with Amazon later so let's have a look at the drills really quickly Number one, which is just a normal size white drill in 5200. That's really sparkly. Number two, which is the same colour basically but just bigger. Number three is 666. It's a lovely deep red colour. Number four, it's like a peach skin tone colour. It's nice. Number five is like a big, bigger black one. So that is for... Ooh. Okay, so every card has its own little baggie. Oh, that's interesting. 
Oh, that's a really good way of doing it. So are they. Ah, okay. So this will tell you. So that was for the Santa face. They were the ones for the Santa face. Because it has number 24 on the back. Oh, I quite like that. They're all in separate little... I didn't even notice before. I knew they were all in little baggies, but I didn't realise it was for the cards separately. So let's see what else we've got here. Even the drills are missing for the polar bear. Now, so this one is for the Christmas tree. This one. We have some lovely red crystal drills. Some big white ones again. Some bigger red ones. Crystal drills. And then we have some really tiny ones, which are a slightly darker colour of red. I don't know if you can see that there. And we have some big red ones. Bigger than those ones, so we'll put the size difference for that. And then we have some pearls, it looks like. They are beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So I won't show you all the bags, so I'll just show you this one more bag. So this one is for... This one is for this Santa. So many special drills in this one. These look amazing. So is that a crinkling? So we have 5200. Very nice. And we have these orange colours for the sack. We have 666 again, 310, 915. I love that the BMC codes are on these 517, 405. That's a very nice bright yellow. Okay, so we have number 8, which are bigger ones. We have number 9, which are like the pearl ones again. And then number 10, which are bigger pearl ones. And then we have these. These lovely little stars. I don't remember how many we need. We need four of them. And they give us five. So I may have to use one for a different project. So, I love those. I am going to contact Amazon now. I know I got them cheap, but I still want my other one. Let me move this one out of the way and I'll get into the other one. Okay, okay. So next up, we have this packet. Oh, and these ones come with envelopes, but see the one also doesn't. I think I was conned. I'm sure I can find some envelopes upstairs somewhere. So, in this one, we have Santa on his sleigh. Come on, camera, focus. And we have a little nutcracker. Let's see if I can get this to focus. And we have a snowman. Candy cane, a penguin, 
Santa's face, a cute little reindeer and a bell. So let's have a look at these. A bit more detail. Oh, and these have got nice messages inside as well. So I'll show you that in a minute. So this is the bell. It's going to have some nice big special gems on that one. Let's see what the message is inside. Oh, look at that. That is so cute. I wish I'd got two of these ones now. These are beautiful. We have Santa's face. Oh, look at his smile. You can just hear him saying ho, 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 can't you? Again, very pretty inside. Merry Christmas with some beautiful deers. Reindeers. Something. We get two tool tips in this. So, oh, pen wax. This is a nutcracker. I'm so excited to do this one. Look at the beautiful colours in that. Oh my gosh! Look how cute that is. I love it. I so love that. Oh, paper's a bit crinkly on this one. So this one is the candy cane. So we're going to have one nice big one here. Lots of different colours. Let's see what the inside of this one's like. Oh, very nice again. So this says, may the glow of Christmas candle fill your heart with peace and pleasure and make your new year bright. Have a love-filled Christmas and new year. I love that. That is so cute. So, a nice penguin. This little trumpet. Again, very colourful. Let's see the inside of this one. That's nice again. Very cute. Santa on his sleigh. Wishing you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Very cute inside again. Oh, I just love these. They're so cute. Snowman. My kids so want it to snow so they can build a snowman. I'm like, no, thank you. Much joy to you in the upcoming year. May the warmest wishes, happy thoughts and friendly greetings come at Christmas and stay with you all year through. I think we all need that message this year after the last couple of years, don't we? <clears throat> and then we have the reindeer. Oh, I'm excited to see what these ones are. Very nice. How cute. Ooh. May you have the best Christmas ever. Oh, look how cute. Okay. So these are individually baggied as well. Let's quickly show you each package. So there's some nice big gold and red ones in here. Lots of beautiful crystals. Beautiful. Lots of whites in this one. That one looks like an AB. Yep, that's an AB, that one. That one's just normal white. I don't know if you can tell the difference in the sparkle. Yeah, you can see all the different light like, blues, greens, and yellows shining on this one. And we have some red, some green, some red bigger crystals in there, some yellow. Oh, that's a nice, like, turquoise colour. Oh, there's some stars in this one. Can you see them there? Some whites, yellows, reds, greens, blacks. Look at that red one. It's huge. Oh, there's more white ABs in this one. 
And a nice red colour there. Reds, greens, yellows, blacks, blues, oranges. That's a lovely little mix, that one. Nice green there. Nice bright yellow. We've got some like really dark red crystals here. Like a lighter, looks like a ready orange colour. This one. Very nice. Oh, we've got that one again. Here. Very nice. Some browns, some reds, blues, and yellows. And then you get your envelopes. So that is what I bought off Amazon. So I may just quickly do a bit of this one. So how was your week? Let me just find the right bags for this one. Just hang on, bear with me a moment. 43, there we go. Again, sorry for the crinkles. So I've got my pen ready. I've got this one out to see. I'll try this one. The special drills. Yes. So number one. So we didn't get up to much at weekend. My husband's away this week for work. So I just had a bit of a chill day on Saturday. I did a bit of food shopping. Yesterday my husband was doing the rugby coaching. So we all went because they have a little craft market on that I wanted to go to to have a nosy. Didn't get anything for me. I've got some cake for the kids and some donut treats for the dog. Actual doggy donut treats. So that was nice because it wasn't quite as cold yesterday really. It has been getting colder and colder and it keeps trying to snow but it doesn't seem to be staying thankfully. I really, I can, that's one thing I can't do with, I can't stand the snow. I don't mind like when the kids are off school and it's Christmas and it looks beautiful. But practically when I have to go out in it, I really hate it because I hate driving in it. It's horrible. Do you like the snow? I really can't be doing with it. So I have something exciting planned for tomorrow for a video. It's something a bit different. I haven't seen any of the other creators do it. So I thought that I would can you see that there? I thought that I would try something a little bit different. So stay tuned for that. I'm excited. I'll be doing a lot of research for it today. That gives you a little clue. So this is number two. So this is for the like skin tone colour, if you will. His face. Yeah, so we went to rugby yesterday and then we came home, chilled a little bit. Um, my husband watched the Formula One. Kids just chilled. We had baths. Ready for school today. I'm loving this one. It's so cute. So, so, so cute. Sorry. Um, yeah, and that was it really. So my husband's away now till Friday. With work, so I will be able to diamond paint as much as I want. Without feeling guilty about it. 
I always feel horrible when he's just left in the other room because he doesn't have many hobbies. Well, he does. He goes out riding his bicycle. But he can't do that at the minute because he's got a knee injury. Which we're waiting for an appointment for. Oh, yeah, I'll stuck myself to it again. Forever doing that. I literally stuck my whole hand to my diamond painting yesterday. Such a klutz. Yeah, so I'm excited to do my research and film a video tomorrow. And I'm also going to try my hand at editing. I'll watch some videos on how to edit my videos. So that I can put pictures and stuff in and maybe a bit of music at the beginning. Just to make it look a bit more nice. Yeah, I really do apologise for the lighting. It's quite dull outside today. I've got all of my lights on that I can possibly have on. But they're still not very bright. Very, very dull out today. Need some more light. So what did you do for the weekend? Because ours was really quiet. We just spent some time together. Seems my husband's not going to be here for the rest of the week. Which was nice. We just had a nice quiet. Nice quiet weekend. This week I'm going to get my Christmas decorations up while my husband's away. I just haven't wanted to do it yet. We normally do it like the first weekend of December. But we were just, like I said, we were just chilling. So my husband's not going to be here. So I said, I'll just do it while you're away. Gives me something extra to do. Instead of just sitting here diamond painting all day, which I would have done otherwise. Not that there's a problem with that, I absolutely love it, but so I will do a little bit of cleaning before I put my decorations up just to make sure it's all sparkly. The only thing I can't do is put the lights up around the top of the room because I don't do ladders. So I'll do the tree and put things on the walls. Put all my little ornaments up on the fireplace. And my little snowman picture. The lights up, which I absolutely adore. And then my husband can put the lights up around the room when he's done. We don't decorate outside. Our electric is expensive enough. Especially at the minute, the way everything's going up. But never mind about that. Um, yeah, we just don't decorate outside. And plus, our, our house is so tall. There's no way my husband would be going up a ladder that big. To put anything on the roof or anything like that. Um, we put lights in the windows inside. So... There's not much point in putting them on the outside. We don't have any 
trees worthy of putting lights on outside. So yeah. But dog's paws have now recovered. She's completely fine. Just in case anybody was wondering. That's looking beautiful already. Very sparkly. What have we got now? Let's put these away. And now we've got black, which looks just a bit on his eyes and a bit on his hooves. Hooves. Hmm, I'm into this bag. Eventually, we we'll get into the back. Do his eyes first. Cute. Oh, these are so cute. I'm so glad about these. Like I said, not quite sure about the other one. But I'll see what Amazon say when I send them a message. Normally quite good with things like that. Okay. Well, to be fair, one pack did say eight pack, but one pack did say seven. Now, there is seven in the other one, but I don't know why there is the picture of the snowman. But there is also no envelopes with it. So, I'm going to have to go and have a look at the list in a bit. But I will stick the link for this one in the description, because I think this one is super cute. And it was a steal. Hopefully, if you're looking to buy some and you're waiting for them to go on offer, then you might be able to grab yourself some. Because these are cute. I like being able to do my own cards. A few years ago, I did some cross stitch Christmas cards, which my mother in law still has one of them. But they just take so much longer. Especially because the ones I did were like full coverage. So it took forever to do a couple of cards, but it was worth it. They did love them. It is that extra special little thing of you made it yourself, isn't it? But I think these are just very sparkly, very fitting for the holiday period. And they're just very quick to do. I might actually get another set of these ones soon as the I like them so much. They are just very pretty. It's coming along very nicely. Looking forward to getting to the seven sunny that was. 
we're on number four now so going quite quickly really aren't we i'm only doing this one and then i will stop I realise that I've been filming now for 30 minutes about some Christmas cards. So hopefully this won't take me too long. So what are your plans for Christmas? Any plans? Are you going to see family? Are you going away? We tend to have a, a quiet Christmas day. It's just us and the kids opening presents, playing games. My daughter's got a karaoke machine this year, so we might be doing some awful singing and bugging the neighbours. Ha ha! Um, and then Boxing Day, we always have a buffet and everyone comes round and we always have enough food to feed the whole street i think we don't waste too much though we always go back and have nibbles all night here and there and then again we play some more games have a few drinks i think i love i love christmas day for the kids and i love seeing the look on their faces when they see all the presents that santa's left but I love Boxing Day for us, because although we, we do a lot for the kids, um, like we play games and stuff, I just like this a bit more adult orientated as well. So Boxing Day is probably my favourite day for me, for the kids obviously. It's I enjoy Christmas Day for them. And it's the one day a year we have our tea early. We never ever eat that early. But we always tend to eat at like three. We don't watch the Queen's speech. I used to watch the alternative speech, but that always seems to be people I don't like now as well so I don't watch that either and has anyone noticed like all the Christmas specials now are just not special like when I was a kid I remember the hype you used to have and all the like Christmas specials and even like up to like five years ago there was always amazing Christmas specials but now it just there's barely anything now it's just rehashes of I think the last one I enjoyed was the new Gavin and Stacey a couple of years ago now everything it just it's a bit boring Christmas telly used to be exciting and I used to love going through the Christmas guide but now I just it's all a bit rubbish really is there anything you love watching at Christmas? I do like watching Christmas movies to sort of get me in the spirit and while I'm wrapping presents. So my favourite one is Home Alone. I know a lot of people say It's a Wonderful Life is like my sister's favourite Christmas film is It's a Wonderful Life and she watches it like five times over the Christmas period. I have literally never watched that movie. I don't know why, it's just never appealed to me. Maybe this year should be the year that I watch it. Just to see what it's about. Um, yeah, so Home Alone, and I like all the... Funny Christmas films. I do like a good comedy Christmas film. I'm not doing very well placing these, am I? So I like Jingle. Jingle All The Way is it called? With Arnold Schwarzenegger in it. 
and deck the halls. Love all the little comedy ones. And then I listen. <coughs> Oi, Poppy! Don't know what she's barking at. She's probably seen a cat, but she scared me then. Yeah, so I listen to Christmas music as well while I'm wrapping the presents. So I do quite like a lot of Christmas music. Some of them I really can't stand. My favourite is either Mariah Carey, yes, yes I know. It's cheese fest, but I love it. My husband hates it. So I play it even more. Um, and I also like the Pogues, Fairy Tale of New York, is it called? So, a very mishmash of favourites. <laughs> but that's me and my weird tastes, I suppose. I like all the cheesy Christmas songs, but I like Slade and. That. You've, got, you've got to have a bit of cheesiness at Christmas, haven't you? But I don't do cowls or anything like that. So, number five. It's not that many of these. I absolutely hate wrapping presents though. My husband is so much better at it than I am, but he never actually tends to do any wrapping. So I'll just try and do a few at a time. I could do with just wrapping them as they come in. And I wouldn't get so overwhelmed because I think, oh, I'll wrap a couple. do a couple and then they just seem to pile up and pile up and pile up and then on Christmas Eve I'm frantically running around trying to wrap presents after the kids have gone to bed so I really kind of need to be slightly more organised really this year So I'd rather just, once the kids have gone to bed Christmas Eve, I'd rather we just chill, maybe watch a film. Instead of having to sit down and wrap presents. I should already have had it all done. So we're nearly done now. Just a few sixes and then the huge sevens. Oh, I have a little imposter. Got a little pink one in here. Little imposter. Put that over there for now so I don't accidentally use it. So I love these little kits. I must say, I haven't actually done anything with special drills before, so I am excited to see what they look like when I put them on. So I may do a couple more of these when I finish filming. 
and then if I do manage to complete some more and I do manage to learn how to edit videos I may put a picture in of the completed ones before I upload Have you done any diamond painting Christmas cards? Did your family like them? I'm going to put more wax on for the sake of doing six more sixes. So I'm going to use that other wax pencil for those big ones. when that happens. And then last but not least we've got these cute ones. So let's see how many extra ones we've got. I'm doing oh, I love this wax pen I suppose once you get used to placing with them it's much better Quickly straighten them out a little bit. And there we go. That looks beautiful. I love that. Very sparkly. And I love the little Christmas card. So, yeah. So thank you for watching, I hope you've enjoyed this video, if you have please give it a like and think about subscribing please, Um, yeah, so I will try and get a couple more of these done today, I will let you know in another video what happens with the other Amazon package Um, and yeah, thank you for watching, I will link these ones in the description below in case you do fancy them. I absolutely love these, especially with the messages inside. They are beautiful. And like I said, I might have to get another pack of these because I do like them. 
Anyway, thank you for watching. I will see you again soon with my exciting new video. Bye.